This video will introduce you to the results list and the My Folder tool in Metalib. The results list allows the user to view, sort, and narrow their search results, save or email selected records, and access full text articles. The My Folder tool allows users to review selected search results, save or email more than one record simultaneously, and organize results from multiple searches. When the user performs a search in either the Quick Search or Cross Search module, Metalib will display the results list for that search. There are two ways in which the user can interact with their search results. They can choose to sort their search results by using this drop-down box on the top right. Results can be sorted by rank, title, author, year, or database. The user can also narrow their search further by using the Clusters and Facets tool on the right side of the results list. This allows them to narrow their search according to a specific category or characteristic. For instance, if we only wanted to view the search results published in this year, we would just click on the 2009 link under the Dates heading. This would display only the 30 articles published in 2009. Should we decide that we have narrowed our search results too far, we can easily return to our original results list by clicking the All Retrieved Records link at the top of the Clusters and Facets tool. The Metalib results list has three different viewing options, and each view provides different information about each record. The user can navigate between the different views by using the links at the top of the results list or, for the citation view, click on the title for a particular record. We recommend that users try to avoid using the back button while in the results list. The best way to move between different views are the links at the top of the results list. Using the back button too many times may result in the user returning to the original search screen and possibly losing both their results and their original search terms. Each time a user performs a search, the result list will default to the Basic Results view, which is the view we are looking at now. The Basic Results view is the most concise of the three results views and shows the user the rank, author, title, year, and database, as well as a small section of the abstract. The Expanded Results view contains slightly more information than the Basic Results view, including the publication in which the article appeared, the full date on which the article was published, and when applicable, volume number, issue number, and page number information. It also includes a longer segment of the article abstract. From both the basic and the expanded results views, you will see a set of two to three icons next to each listing. The S icon is for SFX, our link resolver, which is one of the ways in which the user can access the full text of an article. You will know when the full text is available for a particular article when you see the FT icon next to the S icon. To access the full text through SFX, you can click on either of these two icons. This will open a new window that will list all the places where full text is available for that article. Clicking on the Go button will take you directly to the full text of that article at the vendor's native website. The last icon visible in the Basic and Expanded Results views is the Add to Folder icon. Clicking this icon allows the user to add a record to their My Folder area for later review. This is ideal for users who prefer to collect several articles before deciding which ones they want to use, print, email, or save. The third results view available in Metalib is the Citation view, which most of us would think of as the full record view. The Citation view contains all of the available information on the record. Users can choose to navigate through the entire list using the next and previous links at the top of the Citation view. From the Results or Expanded Results lists, the user can choose to go to the Citation view for a particular article by clicking on the title for that record. There are three different ways to access the full text of an article from the Citation view.
The first way is by using the SFX buttons at the top of the record. These look a little different from the icons on the basic and expanded results views, but they function exactly the same way. The second way to access the full text from the citation view is simply to scroll down. If the HTML full text is available for this article, the entire article will appear at the bottom of the citation view. Finally, an external link may appear at the bottom of the record. Clicking on this link will take the user out to the vendor's website and download the PDF of the article as it originally appeared when published. In addition to accessing the full text, the user has several other actions that can be taken from the citation view. These icons over to the right will allow the user to add the record to the My Folder area using the same icon that is available in the basic and expanded results lists, save the record to their computer with the save icon shaped like a floppy disk, email the record to themselves or someone else by using the send icon shaped like an envelope, or view the record in MARC format with the View Original Format icon. Unfortunately, the print option is not available through the Metalib interface at this time. If the HTML full text is available at the bottom of the citation view, you can use the browser command File and then Print to print this web page. This will print the entire text of the article, but it will look exactly as it looks in the citation view. We recommend that if you want to print an article, that you access that article through the native interface, either through SFX or the external link option. Once you have added several records to your My Folder area by using the Add to Folder icon, you can access those records at any time by clicking the My Folder link at the navigation bar at the top of the Metalib interface. The results saved to My Folder are associated with the user's session and not to any particular search. This means that these results will remain in the My Folder tool so long as the user does not navigate away from the Metalib interface, close the browser window, or leave their computer idle for a long period of time. The user will not lose the results saved to My Folder by going to another Metalib module and performing a search. Users can take any number of different actions from the My Folder module. Users can easily access the full text for any of these articles using the SFX link resolver icons, or they can select any or all of the results and save or email those results simultaneously. Finally, users can also organize their saved results using the Save As icon. Clicking on this icon will enable you to save the results currently in your folder under a name of your choosing. Once those results are saved into their own separate folder, you can delete your original folder. Should you now go out and do a separate search and save results from that search to the My Folder area, they will be saved into a different folder. This will enable you to keep search results on separate topics or for different search terms separate and gives you a great way to organize your results. We will be covering Metalib's three search modules in additional tutorial sessions. Thank you for viewing this tutorial on Metalib's results list and My Folder tool. Should you have any further questions, please contact a KYVL staff member at kyvl at ky.gov or by calling 1-877-588-5288.